The 2015 Harrisburg school shooter has now been sentenced to 10 years in prison after a hearing today at the Lincoln County Courthouse. Now, this decision comes after a probation violation. Kevin Lance Carter Schmidt was in the courtroom today and has the latest. Good evening, Carter. Good evening, Don and Bridget. This case was reopened because of a domestic simple assault charge from 2021 out of Hughes County while Buell was living in Pier. He pleaded no contest at the end of January to that charge. A number of other charges, including rape, were dropped in the plea deal. Today in court, he was sentenced to 10 years in prison for the school shooting case. On September 30th, 2015, then 16-year-old Harrisburg High School student Mason Buell brought a handgun to school and shot his principal before being tackled and held there until police arrived. In 2017, Buell received a suspended 25-year sentence. Judge Bradley Zell, who has since retired, sentenced Buell to 15 years of probation. As long as he did not engage in any violent behavior, he would not have to serve prison time. In court today, Buell's attorney said he was, quote, rebuilding his life and that the 2017 sentencing by Judge Zell was an act of grace. They said Buell is asking for another chance. The now 23-year-old also spoke in court, saying during his probation, he attended Macrossan Boys Ranch, received his GED, has had a number of different jobs, and moved to Pier with family. He says, quote, I felt like things were going good, and his plan going forward is to, quote, do whatever the court has asked of me. Buell admitted to violating probation. State's attorney Tom Woolman argued the 25-year sentence be reimposed and brought up an important part of the 2017 sentence. But at the end of the day, there was a specific provision in Judge Zell's sentence that said no violent behavior. And uh, clearly the defendant violated the condition of that sentence by engaging in a simple assault domestic. Woolman has been involved with the school shooting case since the beginning and says Buell was given a judicial grace. I don't know that the community really had grace. Uh, I mean, they, they went through a lot as a result of this, that sentence. And I uh, met with members of the community over the years um, who didn't necessarily feel safe, uh, that the defendant was basically walking free in the community as a result of uh, that sentence. Today, Judge Rachel Rasmussen said it is not easy to make that determination regarding sentencing for the reopened case. In the end, she reimposed the original 25-year sentence with 15 years suspended and chance of parole. Buell was taken into custody after the hearing to start serving that 10-year sentence at the state penitentiary. And I did ask, but Buell's attorney did not have any comment after the sentencing today.